An 18-year-old has been killed after a train hit them. The victim was a student at Canby High School. Thanks for joining us. I'm Tim Gordon. The incident happened last night, and today some locals suggested to us train safety has been a problem in that area. Blair Best joins us from Canby with the latest on the investigation. Blair. Well, Tim, details are still somewhat limited at this point, seeing as police are still trying to figure out how this happened. But they tell us an 18-year-old was crossing the tracks here just north of South Pine Street when he was hit and killed by an oncoming freight train. Spend an afternoon in Camby and this becomes familiar. Just about everybody's used to it. It's a necessary evil. You know, it's part of our safety. Got to have it. A safety alarm that didn't go far enough Monday night. That's when Camby police say 18 year old Mason Warshaw was hit and killed by a freight train while walking across the tracks. Police say it happened just before 7 p.m. and it appears to be accidental. I have to wonder why he didn't hear it. What was he doing on the railroad tracks? Warshaw was a senior at Camby High School. Terrible. I actually graduated last year. So. Two years ago, the city designated a downtown quiet zone where trains do not blow their horns. But police tell us the tracks where the student died is outside of that zone. Like we could clearly hear the, the train that's coming because they horn, you know, and everything. Sandra uh, lives near the tracks. Were, she yeah. watched the chaos unfold Monday night. And I came out like around nine and they were still here. Mm -hmm. I just pray for the family. The local school district sent a letter of condolence to school families, adding there are counselors available to students struggling to process the loss. I'm sorry for the family. I think it's horrible. I can't imagine going through that. It's going to change their lives forever. Now today we talked with several community members and they all told us that this is not the first time someone has been hit and killed by a train here in Canby and they've been pushing for increased safety around the tracks. Now we asked police about this and we have yet to hear back. Tim. All right, Blair, thanks a lot.